Hi everybody, today I'm going to show you how to make an underwater magnet fishing rig. And basically all it consists of is a, a decorator's pole. I've stuck a, a GoPro mount attached to it. That's just for like um, handlebars for bikes and things like that. But I've put it on the decorator's pole. I've got this housing, this is what you put the GoPro in. Plus it's got a powerful torch in it as well. The reason behind the torch is obviously if it's murky water, um, the bright light will illuminate under the water. Um, this one's good. This is a shoot kangaroo diving light. And these are good because it fits GoPros from like four, five, six, and seven. Um, you just change the inside over um, to suit your GoPro. But the GoPro uh, five, six, and seven will just fit straight in. That's cool. Then obviously you need one of these magnets. So these, um, you can use them two way. You can get the eye bolt, put it in the side, and you can use it as a double-sided magnet. We can put it in the top and use it as a dipping single sided magnet. As you can see it's rusty and well used but it still does a job. And you're going to need a bolt uh, for the right size of the magnet. The good thing about these eyelets is it says uh, it says the size on it for you. So M8 so it's 8mm thread. So when you go to the hardware shop you know what size bolt to buy. This one's an allen key so I've got an allen key bit. And that's it and uh, probably the most important is a thread lock. Because you don't want to go to all this effort and your magnet unscrews and falls off. You'll put it on the thread and it'll stop the thread from coming loose. What I've done, I've because uh, the bolt won't go all the way through, I cut it down just a little bit shorter and then uh, it should be easier. Plus I won't have to pack it out with washers. There you go, just clean any plastic off. And then obviously it'd be ideal if you had a brand new magnet but this is a this is a good little magnet this and I've used it quite a bit. So put loads of thread lock on it. Whoops. A thread lock on that. I'm using the red one, which is the permanent thread lock. You could still get it off if you had like a vice. Um, but it'd take a lot of effort. The blue one I think is sem semi permanent. So that screws onto the end of your decorator's pole. So with these diving lights, they come with an ND filter. So basically if it's really bright, say if you're, you're abroad, um, you put that on and your footage doesn't become washed out. You probably won't need it in the UK because it's never sunny and the water's quite murky in most places. So there you go, really simple underwater magnet fishing rig with a telescopic pole, a diving light to illuminate under the water and a good magnet. All of this stuff is linked in the description below and you can get it off Amazon and uh, let's go and test it out. So first what I'm going to do, I've got to switch the camera on. So the, the GoPro just slides in the, in the back of it. Make sure it's recording. There we go, got a magnet on the end of it. I'm just going to see it. So I'm just making sure I can see the magnet in the shot. I'm going to uh, switch the power on. Boom, brightest setting. <laughs> yeah, see what we can find. Oh, it feels like it drops off. Just before you click away, if you want to see my latest upload, it's just at the top there. If you want to see a video YouTube recommends, it's just underneath it. And don't forget to subscribe, you can see all my latest uploads by clicking the magnet. And I'll see you in the next one.